We're trying to tackle this big intractable problem of hair loss and we believe that we have a solution. Well, a local company is taking a big step in their research into that problem that affects many. We're talking about baldness. ABC 10 News reporter Leah Pizzetti shows us how recent developments in science are getting them closer to a solution. In a San Diego lab, researchers are hard at work at something big. We are curing baldness, so that's the idea here. Co-founder and CEO of Stemson Therapeutics, Jeff Hamilton, says they're confident they can control and create new hair follicles. We take the cells in our skin that are responsible for growing hair, and we direct them in a way that uh, enables a new hair follicle to grow in the skin. Something that's only possible in recent history. Biology is very complicated and trying to control what our cells are doing in the skin is not simple to do. So over the last five to 10 years, technology has advanced and scientific understanding has advanced to the point where we can now control what these cells do. They've been working on this science for the past few years and are now ramping up their operations, adding more researchers and experts to the project with a goal of FDA approval and human trials in the near future. Hamilton says this could be big for many. It's not just men experiencing hair loss, but many women as well. Plus, this could help people who struggle to grow hair back after chemo, giving a mental health boost for all. A lot of studies have shown that it contributes to depression. It certainly uh, damages self-esteem and self-confidence. And so we've, we've learned, we've, we feel like we sort of unlocked this hidden sentiment of people who are looking for solutions. A solution that is taking time to perfect, but could potentially help people all around the world. Leah Pizzetti, ABC 10 News. Hamilton says they've had a lot of interest from people who want to get involved with these trials, but says there is no set timeline on that just yet.